The Schneider Concerts at the New School presents the Abeo String Quartet, Ngio Magrivius and Rebecca Benjamin Violins, James Kang Viola, and Brian Gadbo Cello, in a program of Franz Joseph Haydn, String Quartet in D Minor, Opus 76, Number 2, Composed 1797 through 98. Billy Child, String Quartet No. 2, Awakening, composed in 2012. Dmitry Shostakovich, String Quartet in F Major, Opus 73, No. 3, composed in 1946. This concert was performed live on April 10, 2022, in the New School's historic auditorium at 66 West 12th Street, as part of the Schneider Concerts 2021-2022 season of chamber music. The Schneider Concerts 2021-2022 season is supported by the Alexander Schneider Foundation and is made possible with public funds from the New York City Department of Cultural Affairs in partnership with the City Council and the New York State Council on the Arts with the support of Governor Kathy Hochul and the New York State Legislature. Our thanks to all. We are also very grateful for the support of our audience members. We hope you will consider joining them in making a gift at www.newschool.edu slash gifts slash schneider dash concerts we invite you to turn off your cell phone put on your headphones and enjoy the concert for being here. We're so excited to be here at the Schneider series and what a dream to play on this series after Shasha Schneider. It's exciting for me personally. I feel a little bit of a lineage. Um, I've heard so much about Sasha from my former teacher Jamie Laredo and from Frank Solomon at New York String Orchestra Seminar and um, it's just a delight to be here with you. Um, just uh, a note about the program, the, the Haydn that we'll be starting with is in D minor, not in B flat major, as indicated. Um, it's named the Quintin, or the Fifths Quartet, um, and Haydn constructs the main body of this work after a four-note pattern of falling fifths that um, begin the first movement. He turns this figure up on its head, forwards and backwards in different tempos, and um, passes around each instrument, um, just like a wonderful conversation. Uh, the second movement um, is a plaintive aria from the first violin. The third movement has a canon between um, groups of two instruments. And the fourth movement is very frolicking, and we can imagine Haydn kind of sitting in the corner laughing to himself. <laughs> um, Though the fourth movement ends in a, a bright, sunny D major, most of the work is in um, a very kind of fiery um, and dark D minor. And this is also kind of um, the pattern of the work by Bill Billy Childs. Um, I'm going to read a bit f of what the composer himself wrote, um, as we, we think that it adds to a sort of understanding about the piece. He writes, Awakening deals with my wife's illness and recovery. It basically sets out to illustrate how the experience affected me emotionally, physically, and spiritually. The first movement, Wake Up Call, is about the initial shock, panic, and terror of getting a phone call early in the morning from my wife telling me that she was in intensive care. The White Room is about waiting in the hospital room by my wife's bedside, the most difficult part of the ordeal. Being in close proximity to your loved one while they're suffering and being powerless to do anything to ease the suffering except to wait it out is very tough. Song of Healing is an ode to rediscovery, to a new and more profound appreciation and love for my wife, to new respect for how transient and delicate life is, and about the slow process of healing. We find this quartet to be immensely personal and reminiscent of the emotions and experiences that we've been all going through these past couple years. But along with the Haydn, we feel that through this darkness and pain, um, we can find solace and joy. Hope you enjoy.
Mm-hmm. 
lot has shifted in world events since we decided to play Shostakovich's third quartet on this program. Um, Shostakovich wrote this quartet in 1946 during a period of great upheaval and turmoil, not only um, in his world but in his life. It is well known and documented the amount of censorship that he endured at the hands of, hands of his government. Um, this particular quartet was presented as a war quartet with Shostakovich's own subtitles. Um, he quickly withdrew these subtitles, um, not giving a particular reason, but uh, we think that they give um, a glimpse into what he was thinking when he wrote this. The first movement, Calm Unawareness of Future Cataclysm, has a playful innocence that becomes increasingly troubled. Um, opening with an ostinato in the viola, the second movement, rumblings of unrest and anticipation, is a nervous sort of waltz um, being indicative of a march. The forces of war unleashed lays the tone for the third movement, the crux of the work. And what is just violently engulfed in flames in that third movement is left in ashes in the following fourth movement, which is called Homage to the Dead. Um, Without pause, the cello enters into the fifth movement, and Shostakovich titled it as The Eternal Question, Why and For What Purpose? And here, the garments of innocence from the first movement are stripped off, and we're left with the open and defenseless wounds of what war can bring. We believe that this music today is apt for the times that we're living in. Um, it's horrifying to see what is going on in the world, but shrouded in this darkness of sickness and war, there are so many incredible stories of perseverance and resilience. Shostakovich really captures this dichotomy so clearly, and we hope you enjoy this third quartet. Thanks.
Thank you for joining us for this recording of the Schneider Concert's April 10, 2022 presentation of the Abeo String Quartet, presented as part of the Schneider Concert's 2021-2022 season at the New School's Auditorium at 66 West 12th Street, New York, New York. Billy Child's Awakening performed with permission from Artist Share. Please consider making a tax-deductible gift to keep the series alive in these difficult times. Visit www.newschool.edu slash gifts slash Schneider dash concerts. The Schneider Concerts Chamber Music Series is a program of the New School's College of Performing Arts New School Concerts Department. Rahana Elias Ray is director, Laura Frenzer concerts assistant, Frank Solomon founding director. New School Concerts Artistic Advisory Committee members are John Daly, Pamela Frank, Jamie Laredo, Cho Young Lin, Anthony McGill, Kurt Maroki, Tara Helen O'Connor, and Arnold Steinhardt. Richard Kessler is Executive Dean of the New School's College of Performing Arts. For information on upcoming performances, visit www.newschool.edu slash Schneider dash concerts. To contact us, please email nsc at newschool.edu.